Hey everybody, what's up? Favorite vlogger. Now, make this short and sweet. I'm gonna bypass all the jibber jabber that I normally do. Um, I just saw this video on a worldwide star hip hop. You probably already know what it is by now. If you haven't seen it, I advise you to go check it out. But damn, goddamn, the things you teenagers do that will get you in trouble. Uh, there were these two girls, two young teenagers, I would say, estimate between maybe 15 to 17. They uh, decided to do a twerk video. For those of you that don't know what twerking is, it's when you pose or, or dance up in front of the camera with your butt. You make it clap and bounce and all that nice shit. Now, <clears throat> the thing that... that that made this even more unbelievable was that they posted this bad boy up on Facebook. I believe by now it has been taken down. You can't find it. But what ensued afterwards, Dad found out about that. And guess what? Dad went postal on their ass. Dad beat them. Now, I don't mean like beating like when that judge beat that autistic girl for playing shit on the computer. No, he beat. These girls with a cord, with an extension cord. I mean, he beat them bad. Growing up, when I say growing up, I mean back in the days in the 90s, the 80s. Your parents could do whatever the hell they wanted to do to you. I done got beat with belts, switches. I, my stepdad, I remember one time I did something so bad. I can't remember what it was, but I know when I came home. My stepdad was out in the backyard, and he was cutting down this tree. And I couldn't understand for the life of me what he was doing. He was in the backyard, and he started to carve. And he made this tree branch into a wooden paddle and beat my ass with it. Because I had did something, something that I had did at school, or something that I wasn't supposed to do. And I got towed up. I had two older stepbrothers that got beat with a stitch of cord. Their moms beat them with a cord. But back to the, to the relevant of the video... I watched the first time. I laughed, yo. I laughed. I couldn't, I couldn't stop laughing. After like 10 minutes of laughing, then I finally, I, I looked at it again, and then the, the thought of, oh, you know, good parroting, bad parroting. Nowadays, you got these rules, especially in this country. I mean, now here in Denmark, you can, the golden rules, you cannot hit your child for nothing. For nothing. Now granted, children are going to be children. Same with teenagers. They're going to do something stupid. That's going to get them in trouble. I'm an adult. I couldn't dream of laying a hand on my daughter. Now granted, she does some things. And she's only 13 months old. She does some things that probably annoy me. And I, I, I'm aware when she gets older, she's probably going to do more. That's just, just, just going to get the blood level rising up. But I can never, never hit her. Never hit her. I was raised that a good butt beating made you think twice before you did anything else stupid. Back then, we didn't have Facebook. And we didn't have YouTube. And we didn't have all that shit where you can post your stupidness up online. But, um, I'm just, I'm kind of torn because there's a side of me that realizes he did that to teach them a lesson in a way but to the extent that he did it a little bit too extreme might get him in trouble at one point in time i was raised and, and i tell a lot of people this if if i didn't get a butt beaten from my stepdad i'd probably be out on the street cocaine crack whatever or dead so a lot of people are, well, some people are up in arms about this dude beating their daughter. I personally, I can't get over it. I, laugh. <laughs> I just laugh. I just laugh. I'm sorry. But I think he did the responsible thing as a parent by disciplining them. The style of disciplining, that needed to change. So... But I mean, they teenagers. You can't take their cell phone and you can't take the iPhone or whatever car keys. They'll find some way to get around it. So I guess you just have to instill trust into them or fear, whichever one comes first. 
But um, yeah, yeah. Wild video, wild video. I I, I encourage y'all if you want to seriously see it, please be aware. It's a little bit graphic, but I mean, like I said, I got butt beatings too. I'm used to it. So check it out. Uh, leave comments below what y'all think about it. I mean, if that was you or your daughters or your sons or whatever, how would you handle that situation? For those of you that want to know where I'm sitting at, I'm, I'm sitting outside on my uh, patio just chilling. It's a nice day out. It's finally, hopefully this snow is going away because it's like April now. So it'll be nice. It's nice to sit out here. It's a little bit cool, but that's fine. So hopefully this uh, snow will go away and we'll start having some springtime weather up in here. I'll check y'all later. Favorite blogger. Holla.